mom, check this out. <coughs> Martian spotted over Lincoln Memorial. An eyewitness was said to have seen a large shot. Oh, Danny, White. what did I tell you about reading this kind of filth? I don't want you reading this stuff anymore. They're weather balloons. Weather balloons. Do you understand me? Daniel? Yes, sir. I gotta go. I know. I'll see you when you get home. Be safe. I always am. Aliens are coming tomorrow. Projected at 0900 hours, sir. Why here? Why now? The God-fearing town of Somerset. America, it's, it's Somerset versus the Martians. We're not entirely certain, sir. Have you contacted the president yet? No, I can't get him involved in this. He's got the missile crisis to worry about. If I let him know there are Martians on the way, he could blow his top. No, we gotta... We gotta handle this our own way. When the aliens land tomorrow, we're gonna blow those little green bastards to high hell. Public can't know about this. But they gotta be exterminated. We all in agreement? Permission to take the floor, sir? I... Permission granted. I, I'm sorry, you are... Uh, James Olin, sir. Uh, Jim. Uh, General McCourt. We have a presentation that we would like to share. Three years ago, we captured an auditory frequency that uh, it, it sounded sort of like a high-pitched flute. Um, until two months ago, when this was captured. It, it gets better. <laughs> you see that? You see that movement? How many slides are in this presentation? There are, uh, 40. Well, what the shit? Cut to 40. Uh, um... Um... Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Uh, General McCord, the, the, the radio frequency that we captured, we believe, was captured from the other side. of the galaxy. The, 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 the endless amount of scientific discovery is made possible by tomorrow's landing. This will be the first time in human history that we have made successful contact with extraterrestrial life. I mean, think of, think of the knowledge, the, the benefits, the future I, I, at large. I think we've seen enough of your sci-fi show. Ladies and gentlemen, tomorrow at no 0900 hours, Somerset says hello to the Martians. You're all dismissed. Hey! Fuck you guys, why didn't you have my back in there? We, we worked on this together for years, we're a team! Jim, we're on our ass here, all right? Now's not the time. Our jobs are on the line, and <laughs> I'm up for a promotion. So you sacrifice your integrity? We have kids to feed. Back there. Sir, we are on the precipice of greatness, and to kill them would... Listen, I, I appreciate your enthusiasm and your imagination. It reminds me of my 12-year-old. But, look, I, I'd have you shit-canned. 
if you were an integral to this operation, from my understanding. But you're going to have to understand that tomorrow for the landing, don't get your hopes up. And get a haircut, for good God. You look like Tarzan. Yes, sir. So what happens if you know what happens? Well, it would mean that all of our research was a waste of time. Maria, I feel like my entire life's work is being stripped away from me. I mean, I'm losing the very foundation I walk I just on. don't understand. Why wouldn't they stand up for you? Well, uh, Watson said that it was because they've got kids to feed. I don't understand. I thought you said 0900 hours. That's what our calculations said, sir, but... Maybe they turned around. We're getting a signal. Give me this thing. Ah, 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 ah. Let me see this. I don't hear anything. Jesus Christ. <laughs> sir. You're here. My God. Oh, what did you just do? Just how we say hello, sir. Everybody get back, get back. Oh. I don't understand. Grazie per averci, compagni umani. Uh, grazie. I think they're speaking Italian. I thought they were Martians. Prepare to neutralize. Wait, no, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. God wait, wait, damn wait, it, Olin. Wait, wait, Please. Back. Don't shoot. Put the guns down. Olin, you have till the count of three. No, 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 you can't do this, sir. One. Please, please, stop. Two. Please, please. Just, they are the greatest gift of mankind, sir. They need to be studied. I mean, look at them. They're brilliant. Just, just, just please listen to me, sir. The entire future of humanity, of, of science, rests in your hands. Just, just think of what the rest of the world will think. If, if extraterrestrials sat down here in Somerset and they were welcomed with open arms, you'd be a hero, sir. If you want to kill them, you'll have to kill me. God damn it, stand down. Olin, what did you just do? They're fine. They're heading back to the base. And you and I are going to have a little talk when we get back there. Do you understand me? Olin, you're a crazy son of a bitch. You don't think. It, no, you, you think too much. I want you off this project. I want you off this base. Please, General, you no, can't. No. In the morning, the board is going to publish a resignation on your behalf. The assets of your lab are going to be confiscated. You are Done. No, 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 General, you, you can't do that. I'm the head of the reason. And I'm in charge of you! When I'm done with you, you'll be lucky to get a job in heating and cooling. You're done. 
You're dismissed. Go pack your things. Yes, sir. I think I'm gonna go to the library. This late? Okay. Okay, okay. Um, <clears throat> come with me if you wanna live. Vieni con me. Say, vui, very. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. Oh. Buongiorno. James Olen, homo sapi della terra, 28 anni. Eh, ciao. Hi. Uh, uh, buongiorno, buongiorno, um, uh, uh, fuck, uh, uh, I'm, uh, fuga, uh, uh, es escape bow, you, you, you too, uh, uh, do, der, do's, uh, come a, with me, come a, with me, yeah, yeah. Yeah, all right. Jim? Hi. Where were you? Uh, I can explain. You've been gone for two hours. What's going on? Great, the raccoons are wait, in the wait, 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 wait. Jim, stop. Look, look, they're, they're gone now. Why are you acting like this? I'm sorry, I just had a really rough day. I know. Let's just, let's just go to bed. Oh my god! Okay, oh my okay, god. I told you I could explain. Oh my god. Oh my god, are, are, are these the aliens? Uh, yeah, yeah. And you brought them to our house, Jim! They were gonna shoot them, I had to! Jim? Jim. Uh, what do I do? I think you should let them do it. Are you serious? <gasps> Maria Olen, homo sapi della terra. 28 anni. Mi chiamo Lupo. Mi chiamo Abigail. Abigail? Tu è Lupo. 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 Extraterrestrials arguing in our living room. In Italian. Tu è Lupo. Tu è Lupo. Tu è Lupo. Wait a second. I got an idea. Hold on. Maria! Where are you going? They touched me, and they knew my name! Oh my god, Maria, you're a genius. Uh, excuse me. <laughs> Sorry for the disruption. We have reconciled our differences. My name is Abigail. And I am Lupo. Oh my, oh my god, oh my god, we just, we just taught them English. You, you, you just taught them English. I can't believe it. Oh my god. Wait, why did you come here? Right, uh, to Earth. James Olin, Maria Olin, 
Earth Homo Sapiens. We are here to study your people. In doing so, it takes us roughly 148 years to arrive to your planet. 148 years to arrive back to our homeland to share our findings. 148 years to travel back to your planet for further studying. Our last visit was approximately 1519. A lot has changed. So much to see. So much to do. What is that? Whoa! I'm very sorry about Lupo. He does this sometimes. I was excited, and I am sorry. Somerset. you say prettier They didn't look like this when I was taking them. And, uh, I mean, the kid in the bike is the reason that one's blurry. And they, I mean, I was behind a bush, and it wasn't the most comfortable thing. And the lens was really long. And it... Why is it anytime somebody takes a picture of the Loch Ness Monster or a Sasquatch or, God forbid, aliens living in the neighborhood, they're always the worst pictures ever? I have astigmatism, sir. Get out of here. Yes, sir. Owen family, I present to you our latest invention, and perhaps our best. I present Toast 2. Oh wow, that looks great, Chef Lupo. Bon Appetit. The West is under attack. Fireman. Are, are you an alien? Uh, yeah. Yes. You aren't going to eat me, are you? What? No. This is so awesome. Oh, what's your name? My name is Abigail, age 37,638, Xylemone. Well, I'm only 12 and a half. I am aware. Daniel McCourt, Earth Homo sapiens. No, I like girls. Right. What are you doing? I'm playing with action figures. Can I join you? Uh, sure. This is so cool. You can call me Danny, by the way. Must they always go to war with those they don't understand? I mean, I only have plastic army men, and my saucer's made out of paper plates and tin foil. 
without his gun, he's just a little guy. You can help me rip the rest off if you'd like. The other side of the galaxy. Wow. Hey, uh... Hey, Abigail. Yes, Danny? I don't really know a lot of people, but, uh, does this mean we're friends now? I will be your friend. So, yes. This is so awesome. Hey, uh, hey, Abigail. Do aliens have dreams? I am not sure. I don't know what a dream is. It's like, uh, I don't know how to describe it. It's like a second life when you're asleep. But it only exists inside your head. But it feels real. Interesting. What are dreams about? Well, you can dream about anything. I would like to have a dream. Abigail. Abigail. Where were you? Are you alright? Are you okay? Where did you go? I went outside. You can't leave here. You can't be seen by people. Jim, Jim, calm down. Hey. Abigail, what do you have in your hand? What? what where did you get this? It was a gift. I met a new friend. What do you mean you met a new friend? His name is Daniel McCourt. Oh, Danny. No, Jim. no, 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 no. Abigail, Jim. you can't. Jim. You can't Don't leave here. You can't see him me. ever again. Why not? Abigail. Be Abigail. Because I said so. Jim, take Why? it Why? Because I can't lose you guys. Maybe we aren't yours to lose. What are we gonna do with them? It'll be all right. I'll be calmed down in the morning. Hello and welcome to tonight's show. Hey, Mom and Dad. Why, it's awfully late. Where have you been? I was out playing army. I made a new friend. Oh, wonderful. What's his name? It's actually a girl. Her name's Abigail. That's a beautiful name. Does she live nearby? Yeah, she's actually new in town. Her and her brother are from the other side of the state. I forget who they're staying with. It's Alan, uh, Olden? Olin? Yes, Olin. That son of a bitch. I gotta make a phone call. Owen! James Owen! Come out with your hands up! We have the place surrounded. We know about the Martians, Owen. Oh. Shit! Uh, what are we Come on, Jim! Out, Let's get this over with. Help me out. Toast? Stay, Stay in your room! <laughs> Jim, what are we gonna do? Uh, I'm gonna go out there, okay? No. You guys need to leave. You need to take them out throughout the backyard, okay? What's gonna happen to you? Distract them. Jim! Come on, Jim. Let's get this over with. Olin, you've gone too far. General, you don't understand! Ah! You can't weasel your way out this time. Put your hands up. <laughs> on the ground. Watson? You piece of shit! <laughs> On the ground! Hey, easy! Easy! Abigail, get back in the house. Hello? Neutralize him! Oh, no, 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 no! I said neutralize him! In the house! Please! Fire the damn gun! 
Wait, what are you doing to me? Daniel McCourt Sr., Earth Homo sapien, aged 47. There is much to learn from you. Daniel McCourt Sr., you wanted to be a cowboy when you were a child. You wanted the leading part in the school play, but you were too shy to audition. You didn't want to disappoint your father. You're afraid that people won't respect you, that they wouldn't like you, perhaps because you were different. We have learned that humans, like any other living organism with thoughts and feelings, don't like to be treated different. On one side, you want others to respect you. You want them to admire you. You want them to listen. But on the other side, you want their approval. You want them to love you. Although we are completely different, Daniel McCourt Sr., we are one and the same. I'm sorry. I am. Put, put the guns down. I'm sorry. Olin, you were right. You were right the whole time. Danny, what are you doing here? Dad, this is my friend Abigail I was telling you about. It's nice to meet you. Would you like to join us for dinner? We're having toast. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'd like that. <laughs> my family and yours. I'm sorry for my outburst last night, James Olin. Love you guys. Wait, we're getting another signal. Uh, uh we'll send a return. It appears we're not your only guests. You got any bright ideas now? Oh, I guess we say hello. 